and we're back number three it's just me <laughs> look at New York tonight Ooh. the wind is nice the water is creeping The Empire State is green and red. Mm, money and blood. Blood and money. Where are you in the world? I'm looking at New York City, Brooklyn side, Greenpoint. A couple of nights ago I showed you guys something. I want to show you something again. Uh, of course, you're paying attention to the sun and the moon. Take a little look. It's almost there, a couple of days. I think it'll be a full moon. A couple of days it'll be a full moon. Absolutely blessed to have the weather we've been having the last couple of days. <clears throat> Today's no different. As you can see, you can tell by the water. It's another spectacular night. It was another... It's this little thing falling on me. It's, you're in the perfect position to stay where you are, my guy. Oh, there you go. It was another spectacular day, actually. I worked my ass off, as usual. I got so much done on Dizzy. And I find myself here again, day three. It might even be day four, I might already have mixed up my numbers. I think it's maybe four, actually. I think it's four. I'm learning something every day, I'm getting better. I'm thinking better thoughts about video. I'm sure by the end of this little experiment things will be... Oh, that's better. What do you guys think? What do you guys think? I want to know what you dream about. I want to know your dreams. I want to know how fast you want to go. Do you want to go this fast? Tonight. See what I mean? It's like it's hypnotizing water. It's such a powerful thing. <laughs> wow. What happened today? Too much to talk about. I want to know what happened with you today. Please, tell me what you did today. One sentence, tell me what you did today. And tell me what you're going to do tomorrow. Tomorrow I'm teaching in Central Park at 9.30am. I'm going to try and grab some content for that. And then I need to sing a song and send it to someone who's going to then transcribe it for me. And that's it. It sounds like it's going to be a fun day tomorrow. Not a lot to say tonight, honestly. It's just sometimes when the evening is so beautiful and the day has been won, 
there isn't a whole lot to say. Um, from here on out, I'm going to go and have a cold shower, a natural shower before bed. And I'll probably get up around 4am, I'll be in bed by 10, I'll be up at 4. Work, Central Park for 9, back home for 12. Singing for a few hours, and we're back outside, and then we're back here. But cold showers are something I partake in a lot. Because water is pretty special, or at least I think so, <laughs> or I'm sure you can tell I think so. And when you take cold showers, like natural showers, as close to the temperature of the earth as possible, then really good things happen to your body. A lot of relaxation takes place. I guess that's what I'm going to be talking about tonight, cold showers, because that's where I'm going next. And I just love taking natural showers. really good for the lymphatic system, it's really good just to rub, always just rubbing my head and just standing in the shower for a solid five minutes. I'll brush my teeth in the cold shower. It's so relaxing, especially when it's like 80, 90, 100 degrees outside, it's the best. Waking up in the morning, cold shower, in the afternoon, cold shower, in the evening before bed, cold shower. Nothing relaxes me more than a cold shower. A natural shower, that's what I would call it. So, if you're thinking, who's this guy and what is he up to? I'm just learning to speak on camera and, and building up some momentum. I haven't really got to any of the saucy stuff yet, but we'll get there. Just trying to open up a little bit. And tonight, I wasn't sure what to talk about, so... <clears throat> I just spoke about one of my favourite things to do, and it's what, it, what I'm going to do after this. Head home, start to wind down for bed, cold shower, then some olive oil. Uh, life is too good, I swear life is too fucking amazing. Thank you for another night looking at this beautiful view, breathing in this beautiful fresh Hudson Atlantic Ocean air. Thank you. I don't take it for granted. I don't look at the city as if it's just always there and it's, you can just touch it. It's not that easy. <laughs> I'm so grateful. So grateful. And I hope you're living your dreams wherever you are in your world and you feel that same gratitude every day. Just every day is just a fucking movie and you're grateful. And if you're not, check out Arcadia. I could help you out. I have an apparatus. I have a system. I have a curriculum. You gotta pick up the pace. We have reached the limit. We are out of time. I love you all. And I'll see you next time.